All right, Advent of Code, day 13. Uh, I have folded up. Let's see, we have dots and folds. And you want to know how many are visible? I see, after the first one. Okay. Uh, this is 13, I think. So slow. Okay. Uh, eight capital letters. I see.
this the other way around. I R L D D J G L L E R L D D J G L that L. L U. Fuck. Off by one hours. Very unfortunate. Well, oh my God, R L E D J G L U. Well, that's really unfortunate. <laughs> yep, just typoed that. Okay, uh. R L E C A P L U. All right, <laughs> some issues with part two, but uh. Follow. Okay, so what was going on here? Um, so there's sort of two parts to the input file. Right? First, uh, there's a big long list of points, about 800 of them, and then there's these fold instructions. Uh, so, right, so we read in the points um, into, I don't know, you know some array. I used a dictionary. Uh, and then I guess the tricky part is like, what do you do with the folds? Right? Reading in the points is relatively easy. Um, and so what I believe it means to fold is that, you know, sort of the fold cuts it into like two halves. And if you're in like the top half or the left half, then you do nothing. And if you're in the other half, then you reflect about the line. So what does it mean to reflect about the line? Well, I think it means this, uh, right? You take your distance from the line and then you go above or to the left of the line, like that distance. Right, so this is to reflect about the line x equals b. And similarly, this reflects about the line y equals b. Uh, right, so go up from the line, however far you were down from the line. Go left of the line, however far you were to the right of the line. Um, so we just follow, you know, in part one, we just do one fold instruction, and we're supposed to count how many points uh, we have left. Um, Uh, 
And so, it's uh, the length. So part one was supposed to be 689, yep. Um, Right, so we take sort of our points array and we apply the fold and write them down in a new array and then uh, you know we set the old array to be new array. Uh, so for part one, just after the first fold, we write down how many points we have, and then in part two, uh, we're supposed to just graph the points and see that they uh, make a image, right, of just letters, um, which I messed up a couple times. I guess the key point is uh, you need. Right, so to figure out the dimensions of the grid, I do this, right? It goes, x goes from zero to whatever the max is, y goes from zero to whatever the max is. But you need the plus ones, right? Because there actually are points at like x equals x and, um, and y equals y. Uh, right, range is exclusive in Python. Um, so that tripped me up. And then I just type out it, which was terrible. Uh, anyway, that's it for part two. Um, an interesting case where we don't, you know, the program does not print the actual answer that we need to submit. Uh, we need like a human to read this, uh, which I think is fun. So that's about all there is to say for day 13. Uh, see you tomorrow.